Am I the a-hole for not respecting my stepmom's grief after her mom had passed away? My dad got remarried after my mom died. I 15F was 8 at that time. She was very excited to meet me. I was way less excited. Like not excited at all. My mom died less than two years before that and I knew she and my dad were talking about getting married. I hated it. I didn't get why dad was doing all that so quickly and why they had to get married at all. I said it in front of her when dad told me I shouldn't look so down and she told me I should wipe all that sadness from my memory because she was here now and she'd bring the happiness back and make me forget all about what made me sad. Dad was like oh my god and he told her how bad that sounded. I refused to let her touch me when she tried to apologize and I told her to leave me alone. She talked to me alone a few days after that and told me I could at least try. That dad wasn't sad anymore because of her so I could be too. I told her she couldn't make me forget my mom died. She told me I never gave her the chance to. I told her I didn't like her and I thought she was a bad person. She was horrified by an 8 year old saying that to her face like I did. But I meant it. I still mean it. She tried so hard to get close to me but I didn't want to get close to her. I was quiet around her. I didn't open up to her or share anything with her. My dad sent us on this pre-wedding girl's day because he wanted me to be closer to her during the wedding which only happened a few months after I met her. I ignored her the whole day. She got pregnant right after the wedding and she told me I should be celebrating all this happy news and this new life and instead I looked like I wanted to cry. I told her she'd never get what it's like. We had a really rough time during her first pregnancy. She wanted to include me. I wanted nothing to do with her pregnancy. I wanted nothing to do with her. It frustrated us both for different reasons. She told me to leave the past behind and look forward to being someone's sister. Then she told me most kids would be happy to have a mom again. I brought up the bad person thing again. She didn't try this stuff with her other two pregnancies, but she did always try to make me like her and she tried to make me forget. I don't think kindly of her for that. I have no respect for her. I don't even call her my stepmom. That's respectful and I don't want to be respectful to her. Her mom died not too long ago. She had a really hard time. I didn't care and I didn't try to comfort her or offer any sympathy or kind words. I have none for her. She confronted me on it and I told her she'd forget about it eventually. She accused me of disrespect and then said I'm not being respectful of her grief. I told her she's right. She was never respectful of my grief so I won't be respectful of her grief either. I told her she can wait for her dad to find the woman who'll make her forget. She called me heartless. She said I should care enough about her to not say that. I told her I never cared about her. So am I the a-hole here? Here are the top comments, plus Opie's reply. Everyone sucks here. Your dad married someone when you were clearly not ready to move on and treated your grief in a horrible manner. His wife was dismissive of your loss and tried to replace your mom, which was horrible, especially since you were a kid. That being said, you are not a kid anymore. Your dad deserved to be happy again, and if she is not mean in any other way, maybe you could build a relationship with her. She does not have to be your mom to do that. She is the mother of your siblings, and still you go out of your way to hate someone who met your father to years after your mom died. Grief is a very powerful emotion, but you have to learn how to live with it. You need to find healthier ways to cope with your loss for your own benefit. By the way, your comment on his dad finding someone new was horrible, and you know that because when they did that to you, it hurt you. Still, you decided to be as horrible as her, which makes you in no way better. OP replied, I don't want to build a relationship with her. I want her out of my life ASAP. She's not someone I would ever choose to have a relationship of any kind with. I like nothing about her. You, a teenager, are merely enacting the behavior she showed you when you were eight. And if she's like I knew my mom for my whole life, just say to her and I had known my mom for all of mine when we had met. And you told me to forget her to make yourself more comfortable never acknowledging my grief. Now, I've simply learned it from you that I never need to acknowledge yours. Your dad also kind of sucks for not reigning her in all these years or doing some form of family or individual counseling. Overall, you are not the a-hole OP.